interesting facts about apex predator. An apex predator, also known as a top predator, is a predator at the top of a food chain, without natural predators. Apex predators have a long evolutionary history, dating at least to the Cambrian period when animals such as Anomalocaris dominated the seas. Apex predators are usually defined in terms of trophic dynamics, meaning that they occupy the highest trophic levels. Food chains are often far shorter on land, usually limited to being secondary consumers. For example, wolves prey mostly upon large herbivores, primary consumers, which eat plants, primary producers. The apex predator concept is applied in wildlife management, conservation and ecotourism. Apex predators affect prey species population dynamics and populations of other predators, both in aquatic and in terrestrial ecosystems. Non-native predatory fish, for instance, have sometimes devastated formerly dominant predators. A lake manipulation study found that when the non-native smallmouth bass was removed, lake trout, the suppressed native apex predator, diversified its prey selection and increased its trophic level. As a terrestrial example, the badger, an apex predator, predates on and also competes with the hedgehog, a mesopredator, for food such as insects, small mammals, reptiles, amphibians and the eggs of ground nesting birds. Removal of badgers, in a trial investigating bovine tuberculosis, caused hedgehog densities to more than double. Predators that exert a top-down control on organisms in their community are often considered keystone species. A keystone species is a species which has a disproportionately large effect on its natural environment relative to its abundance, a concept introduced in 1969 by the zoologist Robert T. Payne. Keystone species play a critical role in maintaining the structure of an ecological community, affecting many other organisms in an ecosystem and helping to determine the types and numbers of various other species in the community. Without keystone species, the ecosystem would be dramatically different or cease to exist altogether. Some keystone species, such as the wolf, are also apex predators. Humans are not considered apex predators because their diets are typically diverse, although human trophic levels increase with consumption of meat. Apex predators can have profound effects on ecosystems, as the consequences of both controlling prey density and restricting smaller predators, and may be capable of self-regulation. They are central to the functioning of ecosystems, the regulation of disease, and the maintenance of biodiversity. The removal of top-level predators, often through human agency, can cause or disrupt trophic cascades. For example, reduction in the population of sperm whales, apex predators with a fractional trophic level of 4.7, by hunting has caused an increase in the population of large squid, trophic level over 4, carnivores that eat other carnivores. This effect, called mesopredator release, occurs in terrestrial and marine ecosystems, for instance, in North America. The ranges of all apex carnivores have contracted whereas those of 60% of mesopredators have grown in the past two centuries. These are some examples of the top apex predators on the planet. Let us start from the air, the great skua, Stercorarius skua, sometimes known by the name Banksy in Britain, is a large seabird in the skua family Stercoraridae. It is roughly the size of a herring gull. It mainly eats fish caught at the sea surface or taken from other birds. The great skua is an aerial apex predator, both preying on other seabirds and bullying them for their catches. The English name and species name skua is believed to originate from the Faroese and is the only known bird name to originate from the pharaohs that has come into regular use elsewhere. Peregrine falcons, apex predators that hunt near rock cliffs and skyscrapers strike like a stock market crash, fast and hard. The birds fly to great heights, then tuck their wings and plummet. Mid nose dive, falcons have been clocked at 220 miles per hour, equal to the top speed of a Formula One race car. The dive, called a stoop, is the deadly tactic that falcons use to catch other birds. A large, crow-sized falcon, it has a blue-gray back, barred white underparts, and a black head. 
According to a National Geographic TV program, the highest measured speed of a peregrine falcon is 389 km per hour, 242 miles per hour, making it the fastest bird in the world, as well as the fastest member of the animal kingdom. As is typical for bird-eating raptors, peregrine falcons are sexually dimorphic, with females being considerably larger than males. The Philippine Eagle, Pithecophaga jeffreyi, also known as the monkey-eating eagle or great Philippine eagle, is a critically endangered species of eagle of the family Echipetridae which is endemic to forests in the Philippines. It has brown and white-colored plumage, a shaggy crest, and generally measures 86 to 102 centimeters, 2.82 to 3.35 feet, in length and weighs 4.04 to 8.0 kilograms, 8.9 to 17.6 pounds. The Philippine eagle is considered the largest of the extant eagles in the world in terms of length and wing surface, with only stellar sea eagle and the harpy eagle being larger in terms of weight and bulk. The most significant threat to the species is loss of habitat, a result of high levels of deforestation throughout most of its range. Killing a Philippine eagle is punishable under Philippine law by up to 12 years in prison and heavy fines. The bald eagle, Haliaetus leucocephalus, is a bird of prey found in North America. A sea eagle, it has two known subspecies and forms a species pair with the white-tailed eagle, Haliaetus albicilla, which occupies the same niche as the bald eagle in the Palearctic. Its range includes most of Canada and Alaska, all of the contiguous United States, and northern Mexico. It is found near large bodies of open water with an abundant food supply and old growth trees for nesting. The bald eagle is an opportunistic feeder which subsists mainly on fish, which it swoops down and snatches from the water with its talons. It builds the largest nest of any North American bird and the largest tree nests ever recorded for any animal species, up to 4 meters, 13 feet, deep, 2.5 meters, 8.2 feet, wide and 1 metric ton, 1.1 short tons, in weight. Sexual maturity is attained at the age of 4 to 5 years. Bald eagles are not actually bald, the name derives from an older meaning of the word, white-headed. The adult is mainly brown with a white head and tail. The sexes are identical in plumage, but females are about 25% larger than males. The yellow beak is large and hooked. The plumage of the immature is brown. The bald eagle is the national bird of the United States of America and appears on its seal. In the late 20th century it was on the brink of extirpation in the contiguous United States. Populations have since recovered, and the species was removed from the U.S. government's list of endangered species on July 12, 1995, and transferred to the list of threatened species. It was removed from the list of endangered and threatened wildlife in the contiguous states on June 28, 2007. Next stop Apex Predators that Occupy the Land The Burmese python, Python bivitetus, is one of the largest species of snakes. It is native to a large area of Southeast Asia and is listed as vulnerable on the Yukon Red List. Until 2009. It was considered a subspecies of Python molaris, but is now recognized as a distinct species. It is an invasive species in Florida as a result of the pet trade. The Burmese python is a dark-colored non-venomous snake with many brown blotches bordered by black down the back. In the wild, Burmese pythons typically grow to 5 meters, 16 feet, while specimens of more than 7 meters, 23 feet, are unconfirmed. The Burmese python occurs throughout southern and southeast Asia, including eastern India, southeastern Nepal, western Bhutan, southeastern Bangladesh, Myanmar, Thailand, Laos, Cambodia, Vietnam, northern continental Malaysia, and southern China and Fujian, Jiangxi, Guangdong, Hainan, Guangxi, and Yunnan. It is an excellent swimmer and needs a permanent source of water. It lives in grasslands, marshes, swamps, rocky foothills, woodlands, river valleys, and jungles with open clearings. It is a good climber and has a prehensile tail. It can stay in water for 30 minutes but mostly stays on land. 
The Fossa, Cryptoproctopharox, is a carnivorous mammal that is endemic to Madagascar. It is a member of the Euplaridae, a family of carnivorans closely related to the mongoose family Herpestidae. A rare apex predator, Fossa is the largest mammalian carnivore on Madagascar and has been compared to a small cougar, as it has convergently evolved many cat-like features. Adults have a head body length of 70 to 80 centimeters, 28 to 31 in, and weigh between 5.5 and 8.6 kilograms, 12 and 19 pounds, with the males larger than the females. It has semi-retractable claws, meaning it can extend but not retract its claws fully, and flexible ankles that allow it to climb up and down trees head first, and also support jumping from tree to tree. A larger relative of the species, Cryptoproctospelia, probably became extinct before 1400. The species is widespread, although population densities are usually low. It is found solely in forested habitat, and actively hunts both by day and night. Over 50% of its diet consists of lemurs, the endemic primates found on the island, tenrex, rodents, lizards, birds and other animals are also documented as prey. Its classification has been controversial because its physical traits resemble those of cats, yet other traits suggest a close relationship with viverids. The fossa is listed as a vulnerable species on the Yukon Red List. It is generally feared by the Malagasy people and is often protected by their foddy taboo. The greatest threat to the fossa is habitat destruction. The praying mantis, mantises are in order, mantadia, of insects that contains over 2,400 species in about 460 genera and 33 families. The largest family is the mantidae, mantids. Mantises are distributed worldwide in temperate and tropical habitats. At the top of the apex predator list for insects, the brain mantis is the most stunning. Not only was it named for looking like it's praying, but it's also brutal and can easily take down beetles, crickets, flies, bees, wasps, and even lizards and frogs with its spiny four legs, lightning fast speed, and voracious appetite. They have triangular heads with bulging eyes supported on flexible necks. Their elongated bodies may or may not have wings, but all mantadia have four legs that are greatly enlarged and adapted for catching and gripping prey. Their upright posture, while remaining stationary with forearms folded, has led to the common name brain mantis. Although spiders are its main predator, the larger the mantis is, the most likely it is to escape their webs. And it looks like it's doing just fine, with its population listed as least concern. Found worldwide in both temperate and tropical habitats, the brain mantis is known for its large, triangular head bulba size, and ability to grasp prey with its spiked forelegs. Last stop water, the killer whale, also known by its more benign sounding name the orca, looks cute and magnificent to watch while it leaps in the water, don't be fooled, it's very deadly, attacking sharks, whales, and other large sea creatures and eating 100 pounds a day. The orca or killer whale, Orsonisorca is a toothed whale belonging to the oceanic dolphin family, of which it is the largest member. It is recognizable by its black and white pattern body. A cosmopolitan species, orcas can be found in all of the world's oceans in a variety of marine environments, from Arctic and Antarctic regions to tropical seas, they are absent only from the Baltic and Black Seas, and some areas of the Arctic Ocean. Orcas have a diverse diet although individual populations often specialize in particular types of prey. Some feed exclusively on fish, while others hunt marine mammals such as seals and other species of dolphin. They have been known to attack baleen whale calves, and even adult blue whales. Orcas are apex predators, as they have no natural predators. They are highly social. Some populations are composed of very stable matrilineal family groups, pods which are the most stable of any animal species. Their sophisticated hunting techniques and vocal behaviors, which are often specific to a particular group and passed across generations, have been described as manifestations of animal culture. 
The saltwater crocodile is the largest crocodile and the largest living reptile around and is listed as least concern on the Yukon Red List. It also likely to win in a fight against its cousin, the alligator. Although females are much smaller, males grow up to 23 feet in length and weigh up to 2,205 pounds. The average adult crocodile's teeth number 66 and have the greatest bite pressure of all animals, while its average lifespan is 70 years and over. The saltwater crocodile, Crocodilus process, is a crocodilian native to saltwater habitats and brackish wetlands from India's east coast across Southeast Asia and the Sundaic region to northern Australia and Micronesia. It has been listed as least concern on the Yukon Red List since 1996. It was hunted for its skin throughout its range up to the 1970s, and is threatened by illegal killing and habitat loss. It is regarded as dangerous to humans. The saltwater crocodile is the largest living reptile and crocodilian known. Males grow to a length of up to 6 meters, 20 feet, rarely exceeding 6.3 meters, 21 feet, or a weight of 1,000 to 1,300 kilograms. 2,200 to 2,900 pounds. Females are much smaller and rarely surpass 3 meters, 10 feet. It is also known as the estuarine crocodile, Indo-Pacific crocodile, marine crocodile, sea crocodile or informally as salty. Thank you for watching hope you learned something new today. Please hit like and subscribe.